This is the update for Anna's programming data glove uh, that's designed to pick up very small movements of the fingers. Um, the levers here uh, can slide through the finger and um, there's a magnet here and a magnetic sensor under here. So by bending the finger the magnet is being either lifted. In the relaxed state the finger is already a bit bent. Um, when it's lifted the magnet comes closer. When it bends more the distance becomes bigger. Um, the biggest problem with this design still is that the mounting on the fingers, the height is so high that when it's bent there's um, not so much difference uh, when it's relaxed and uh, lifted. So we're going to try to design these rings to have a lower profile kind of shaft uh, or sheath in which the levers move. But you can see in the background the graph uh, for the index finger, middle finger, ring finger, little finger, and the thumb also has two sensors for uh, left, right, and up and down. And yeah, the glove consists of the five individual rings at the moment, which we might change, and um, this unit with these. So if you take it off, you undo the strap, and you can just pull off this part, and um, the rings stay on the hand. And the circuit is solved such that each kind of sensor shaft is mounted on a, a snap that allows it to kind of pivot around it and the snap doubles as the common ground for all sensors. And then the positive rail runs here along the edge and there's a little wire soldered to the copper tape sewn to the conductive fabric. And for the individual signals, there's also wire, and then they get sewn here to this perforated circuit board and plugged into the cable. And the noise on the graph are actually the, sense, uh, the six sensors from the other hand that aren't connected at the moment, so it's only the top signals from this glove.